Hi guys, it's Liz from Little Homestead on the Hill, and today I'm going to teach you guys how to make homemade syrup, so stay tuned. So homemade syrup. How many times have you guys went to give some for your kids? You don't have any. You would like some for on top of your ice cream or maybe some brownies or something and you don't have any. So let me teach you how to make it at home. It's so simple. So let's go to the stove. First thing we are going to do is turn on the stove, which I just did. And we are gonna take one third cup of water and pour that into our saucepan. And then with that one cup of sugar. And we are gonna let that dissolve. We are going to cook this over medium heat for two minutes. to a simmer I'm going to add my one cup of milk and then let that simmer again and now I'm going to add just a little bit of salt now that has come to a simmer right there then here it is grab our 12 ounces of chocolate chips I grabbed Hershey's um milk chocolate chips so I am going to open the bag and I'm going to turn off the heat and I'm going to pour those in just like that and I'm going to do a little whisk and get those all incorporated so the next thing I'm going to do is take this off the stove underneath it so I don't burn my countertop and I'm gonna just keep stirring this now that it's all smooth and all the chocolate has melted I'm going to add in a little bit of vanilla extract so I'm gonna use my homemade vanilla extract just like that and then I am going to stir that in two mason jars here one two so I am going to open those up just like that and I'm going to move this over in my hot plate thing I'm going to grab a mason jar and a funnel now this is very liquidy but it will thicken up as it stands so I'm just going to fill up my mason jar. So there's one. I'm going to put that off to the side. And fill up my other one. Just so like that. Now what I'm gonna do is let these cool down for a little bit and then I will show you what it looks like once it's been cooled down and put in the refrigerator and what the consistency will be like after. These have set in the fridge for about 10 minutes. I just wanted to show you that they do thicken up. See that? It is getting thicker. It will get a lot thicker. So, but I'm gonna put some in some milk and pour it in. Just remember, this is a lot thinner than what it will look like when you're done with it. So I'm gonna stir it up. Actually, 
on that a little bit more. Let me get a clean spoon. Because I like a lot of chocolate in my chalky milk. So. And there we go. Chalky milk. So what you do with these, you just want to put the lids on them. You could put a label on them if you want to. You could write on the lids. And put them in the fridge. And these will last in your refrigerator for, let's say, probably up to like three weeks. And you can also freeze this too, and it'll be good in your freezer for six months. But there you go. Two things of chocolate syrup, and it's gonna be so much better than it was that you bought it from the store. So, let's give this a taste. So here we go, chocolate milk. Mm. That is so good, you can really taste the Hershey's chocolate in here. So I hope you tried this recipe. I hope you guys have a great day. I will see you guys in my next video. Bye guys. Ooh. Ooh.